In the CAT lab, an adult man was undergoing surgery by visiting pediatric interventionist cardiologist Dr. Vinat Senkla and his nurses. This is the same lab where six children from Kujib Nazarene Hospital in Jiraka province who have suffered from congenital heart disease or hole in the heart disease will be operated on in the next five days. For Hearts and Souls partnered with Lila Foundation in providing and supporting logistical support for these six children and their guardian. The procedures being performed at PIH is called Patent Ductus Arteriosus or PDA catheterization. The PDA is a blood vessel that is open while a baby is in its mother's womb. It allows blood to bypass the lungs since the baby is not yet breathing. It normally closes shortly after birth. If it remains open, it can cause heart and growth failure in children and may lead to decreased lifespan. Pediatric cardiologist Dr. Kirk Malone says the procedure is simple and patients can move around right after the surgery. Uh, and we would expect this, this would, the, in a minute, as soon as that device is to place, place uh, their life is starting to change. For Hearts and Souls is a missionary organization. The founders, Dr. Kirk Mullan and his wife, pediatric cardiac anesthesiologist, Dr. Kimberly, have been providing pediatric cardiac medical outreach and performed 600 surgeries in 11 countries, including PNG. The families of the six children said they are very grateful for the doctors to operate on their children. Seven-year-old Caleb Alukolip was the second patient to undergo the surgery yesterday. He was diagnosed with the disease on August this year. Caleb's mom, Noreen Kolip, says she thanks God for bringing these doctors to them. Kain operation also me cost it too much. Na me pla kain online no na pla for dim cost long operation na transport fees na all get a me pla almost through all them. He got missionary team staff na all enough make it possible to me pla local. Some of these children have been suffering from this disease for years, and this surgery can give them a second chance to fully live their lives. Michelle Steven, National MTV News.